Hello and welcome back to another video guys. In this video I'll just kind of go through this fault cone which is quite common. Oh, I'm going to say very common but it happens anyway. Um, it's sensor isn't it? So this is the BMW M4, M3, uh, M5 as well. They're all very similar in terms of this sensor. So it's coming up as this faulty which more or less every suspension has this because it's a performance car. Um, and that is usually found. Now, it's a DIY job, honestly. It's piece of piss if you ask me. So, jack it up. And then the sensor is here. If you're going to buy it, you might as well buy both. That's the cable. What goes there. Take this front arch off, obviously, the wheel and jack it up and stuff. Um, and these go faulty, obviously, because of muck and grit and all sorts of water and all that uh, kind of do it in but yeah this probably i'd say what we're talking i'd um be saying about 150 200 ish depending on where you get it from but my advice would be get a new genuine one don't go cheap and buy a second hand one because they could be in the same boat as you are so for the sake of a few quids just buy a new one that's how easy it is and the jobs are good and really 